Well, hello. Uh, I just I did a video recently of uh, a flight using flight simware sim where as the uh, new universal UNS one dash FMS flight management system, uh, and the flight was from uh, Boston Logan Airport, Boston's Boston's Logan International Airport to Nantucket. And uh, uh, it was a, about an hour long flight, and I uh, I showed some things on how to use the uh, UNS one, but uh, I figured I'd do a, a shorter version uh, just to introduce this to people. I am not with flight somewhere, of course you know that. Uh, uh, so anyhow. I, uh, this is uh, the the system that I guess was used in the 1980s and it's still in some planes today uh, for uh, navigation as an FM assist system. Okay, so here we are in the Learjet 35A, uh, and this is the Universal. FMC, All right, right by in the pedestal area. Okay, to activate it, you press the power dim key, and then it goes through a series of tests. And then you uh, can press the accept key. And you're ready to go. Uh, right now, they're taking. They have. They have the Arix Navidates. Navid I should say this is on a beta testing uh, device at this stage. It is incomplete. So, uh, but the Arix are the new Arix month-to-month Arix uh, Navigar databases are put in here, but it doesn't show it. For some reason, it says nav database expires. So, but supposedly they're in there. If you look in the files, you can find them. <clears throat> so anyhow, to add a route, if you have if you have routes already made, one way to do it is go to flight plan and go to. Uh, some other page, I don't know, doesn't matter. Then return, and you'll see copy uh, flight plan route. If you press that, a, a list of your saved routes will come up, and you can just choose the line number and put it in to, to, to get your saved route. Like the one I used was route seven, the seventh route, and I put that in, seven. Put the enter, you suppose seven, enter. Put the enter in there. Then the route pops up. That's what it is. Okay. And this is the route I have in here, which is uh, uh, K Boss uh, Logan 2 departure to, to uh, Sayote. Uh, and next goes to uh, PVD and a newbie 3 approach in, into uh, CAC, K A C K, which is uh, Norgatuck Airport. All right, and then I'm going to runway 24 uh, with an ILS approach. Now, just just so you know, this doesn't do ILS approaches. It, it'll uh, put the runway in. And unfortunately, yeah, right now it doesn't. It does It's not coordinated with a, a device to give ILS approaches. So you have to go back to the standard uh, method of ILS approaches. All right, so we deleted the flight plan. Uh, and I did that by going to menu, delete flight plan. Okay, so now with your flight plan, if you normally it'll it'll give you your your starting point, but let's we can put it in. You can put it in by going just typing it in. Then 
and then you say accept. Or another way you can do this is I think there's a menu, a listing of the different waypoints lists. And it gives you a list of uh, airports. You could use this way of doing it. And you would say one for K boss. So I'm just going to show you how to, do, to put the flight plan in. Enter. Accept. Uh, P. P. D. Enter. Accept. Uh, I guess that's it. K A C K Enter Accept Now uh, you can go to the menu here and you can uh, departure you press departure there and it's in choose your runway which in my case it's I'm going to choose runway 4 And it gives you your your SIDs available for that runway, and then this one is Logan too. And I'll I'll, I'll I'll choose that. Enter. And hit the flight plan, and that's in there now. All right. And also for the departure, you put men for the I mean the arrival. Put arrival. Choose your runway. In my case, it's going to be number four, which is 24. Enter. And the star, I'm going to choose new B3. Enter. And it's PVD is this transition. Enter. And the approach is going to be ILS 24. Enter. And the transition is O oh, O oh, booby O oh, booby. Don't get a booby, but go to O oh, booby. Enter. And so there is the completed flight plan. And you can save that. You can store it under the menu. store a flight plan and choose it oh enter and it's stored and then if you call up your menu list of flight plans uh, no you you can't pull, call up the the list of your flight plans unless there is nothing in your field so uh, you can't have a waypoint in there it won't, won't you won't be able to call up the flight plans so that's it. That's the introduction to this uh, uh, piece of equipment. And remember, it's in beta, so they're going to be coming out with uh, more features uh, for it. So, hope you enjoyed this uh, little tutorial. We'll see you. Bye-bye.